Hello good people, I am BT Africa. Welcome to the Wataka TV YouTube channel. Thank you so much to the people who have constantly been supporting us. Uh, I think firstly we'd like to just apologize to the very same people who've been very consistent with supporting us and we went a wall <laughs> uh, this year. I think this is the very first video we upload in this year, but yeah i was going through the most <laughs> but i am back and better and every single thursday we'll be dropping a review talking about proudly local content first and seeing what other international you know shows and productions are bringing to our screens and hopefully we'll talk about some of them i am busy africa and thank you so much for honoring us with your time i think today let's talk about young famous and african streaming on netflix so Young Famous and African is a reality show. It has various media personalities, uh, famous all across the African continent and the world, uh, mainly South African and then Nigeria. And then I think the others from Ethiopia uh, stand to be corrected to various cast members in, in this reality series. Um, and I think, you know, everyone has a lot to say about this show, right? And for me, in my view, I think it works because it's a well-curated mess. <laughs> and I say that because when you look at how it's shot, it's shot well. Uh, when you look at the events, it's okay how things occur in the series. Uh, I do think sometimes the conflict did appear as curated. I mean, when you introspect about Kanye and Naked's conversation in episode two at that list one that hurling of insults i was like this is not lending well it seems very performative and uh, we'll see how things go uh, as time goes by uh but yeah it seemed uh, slightly curated um and i think it could have worked one i can use an actor right i think it could have worked if they briefed naked and Oh no, no, no. I think it could have worked if they briefed Kanye that we wanted this out of the scene. Take it outside of Nikki. Nikki will just see this girl she identifies as a sister to her, hurling insult and he would reciprocate and retaliate organically. I think, you know, um, <laughs> you know, and, 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 and at some point it felt like it was Kanye's show because Kanye had to be right. <laughs> what Kanye said was the one and Kanye was never doing any wrong even though her diary sessions were like, oh, you are a shady queen. <laughs> you know, uh, but you know, big ups. I think Nadia also owned her time on screen and he was so personal. Oh, at some point I was like, girl, don't do that because it's gonna backfire. They're gonna use that and run with it. And it felt like, indeed, at some point it became any story. But it, they gave them a nice resolution based on what happens in episode seven. So it's seven episodes of pure bliss, seeing this young, famous, and rich. <laughs> They didn't show us how rich they are. They wore nice clothes. <laughs> but we didn't see someone go to fetch a car. You know? <laughs> I mean, there were blue trains, but we're not sure. Is it production or is it the host? <laughs> <laughs> You know, uh, you know, events that happened on the blue train, it felt didn't come across as like organic fights, you know? Um, but I love, I, I, I love drama and I love reality show and I love what, what happens on reality show and, and I, I think it's, it's binge worthy. I mean, a few ladies who are experts in her were trashing down the ladies wigs. I didn't see any problem until they started saying, oh, this wig is not fixed right. And they were like, oh, you guys didn't give the wig department the right budget. And I was like, oh. <laughs> and I just saw wigs that looked nice. <laughs> That complimented the outfits well. Um, but yeah, man, I think they, 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 you know, the stars opened up a bit to their reality. I don't think Platinum opened as much. Also, we, at some point, we didn't see him and we didn't see about his life. Um, I think Naked, uh, you know, uh, and Carly opened a bit um, about their relationship, uh, which was nice. Uh, but you know the way they, the way they portrayed naked, like he, he's 
I don't want to say any vulgar term, but <laughs> you judge him after you see what you see. And obviously, I mean, there's a point where Andile goes to Zari's house, uh, surprisingly, uh, without letting her know. And let me tell you a fact about South African estates. Yeah, there's security guards literally at the gate where it guards all the houses that are in that residential area so you can't go in without one a fingerprint access or a security card if they're still using security cards or somebody answering a call and saying this person can come in right so the whole andili didn't tell me and andili is at the door <laughs> yeah we believed you guys <laughs> but you can't fault them. I, it, it feels like a, a value for money production. It's just the way it looks. Not for me, the way it looks, the picture quality, the editing, those shots. Uh, I, I enjoyed them. Yo, I, I love me some aerial shots. Um, they could have added more cars and then that cutaway shots. I think Kanye's glamorous yellow sports car was overused. <laughs> I can't be shady. <laughs> You know, but I think it would have been nice to just get more real and, and into their individual lives um, But we've seen them in their houses and it, it was those moments were nice Those moments were nice uh, the relationship the dynamic between Kanye and her daughter That was beautiful and something I guess new to, to most of us, you know and yeah, man, it's Young Famous and African. If you've watched it, what are your thoughts? Are you looking forward to season two? Do you think they should recast for season two? I think it would, it would be nice to see season two and different cast members. But you know what? I think as consumers, we're very hoarding. I think now, by now, the show belongs to like, you know, the stars that we know, right? Um, for them to introduce a differently complete cast, Woo I'm not so sure how you know audiences would receive that. How would you receive it if they introduced a different cast? Would you receive it well? Uh, share your thoughts with us as young point as an African. I am PT Africa. Thank you so much for tuning in to Wataka TV. And this year we are being unapologetic about asking you to help us grow. So please do subscribe. Uh, we are trying to get monetized. So please do subscribe and hopefully before the end of the year that will happen uh but we continue to unapologetically push thank you so much for us with your time <laughs>